A little brief history on how I got started in construction. Um, when I was younger, I helped my dad build a garage and I really fell in love with building a garage. And the next thing you know, I uh, wasn't sure if I wanted to be in the office as a project manager or out in the field as a worker working him, him, him his way up to superintendent. First went to college for four years. I did get a degree in construction management, but before I was even out of college, I knew that I wanted to pursue the field option and work my way up. And as soon as I got out of college, I got an apprenticeship and then worked my way up to foreman, superintendent. And I've been with Riley Construction almost 25 years. A typical day, get on the job site, unlock everything, open up job, job boxes, um, get the guys together with a little quick huddle in the morning just to find out what they're going to be doing, um, steer them in the right direction, and then uh, get them off on doing their tasks. Take a quick walk of the job site, making sure the subs are on task. A bunch of meetings throughout the days and phone calls to different subs and engineers trying to figure out problems and issues. Some of the difficult aspects of my job would be you have the job planned out, you have it scheduled out, and then some of the unforeseens that nobody had seen before pop up. And then you have to change your whole plan or just adapt to the new outcomes and new processes. Some of the most important qualities a person should have with being a superintendent. You definitely have to be flexible. Communication is also a key quality that is needed in a superintendent. We talk with, super, with subcontractors daily. You have to get along with them. You have to know how to speak with the subcontractors. With the owner, at least once a week, you're talking with owners. Here where I'm working, you're downstairs talking to staff. That is a little bit more of a day-to-day -day because you need to explain to them what you're doing. So communication is key uh, with talking with clients, owners, and other staff on the job site.